up? It's Kendall Schmidt from Half Hour Drive and Big Time Rush. My new single Parallel is on iTunes right now. And you're watching Celeb Secrets for you. They're just for you. Amazing. We actually just got a chance to say what's up on the carpet. I saw Avin Jogia and I actually rode here with Ariana Grande. So it's all it's all great. Yeah, it's a nice little reunion. It's for the kids and it's fun and they're so happy to see everyone and all of their favorite TV stars and movie stars and all that. And you know, I think like a high school or school just got out behind you. It's like it's so nice, you know, it feels like they deserve it. Well, I mean it's Nickelodeon. I think as far as award shows or anything goes, Nickelodeon always does it the funnest. You know what I mean? Nickelodeon is known for being fun and messy and gross and and like you know oh I mean you know just we had to come here and see a bunch of friends and, and like everyone is just literally in such good spirits at all times you know, no matter if you win or you lose or you know, you're not even nominated it's just like the, one of the funnest you know one of the funnest experiences of the year and I always enjoy and I always look forward to it coming back around I think it's just fun because it's you know there's a bunch of kids here it's all about the kids it's all about slime it's all about having fun and music so I mean it's just a good time we're hosting the red carpet this year who are you most excited to talk to I I was most excited to talk to you, Kel Mitchell. I mean, Good Burger, Keenan and Kel. I mean, these are all classics, and he's such a funny guy and so and so so sweet. So there is a battle between Cody Simpson, Austin Mahal, who's getting slime. Who would you want to see get slime? Ah, uh, Cody. Cody. I'm rooting for Cody. Austin Mahal. Cody Simpson. Both. Um, I'm really good friends with both of them. I feel like they would both handle it in really different ways. I think it'd be really funny. I think Cody would be like really freaked out. I think Austin would be expecting it. So I think that'll be really interesting. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know. Probably, probably Cody. Maybe. I feel like he'd be wearing like lighter colors, and the slime would really, you know, mess his clothes up. Now Nickelodeon is known for sliming people. Do you want to get slimed? No. <laughs> so I really don't want to get slimed. I'm a little nervous. <laughs> I've been, I, I had been slimed once before, and it was, it was. I lived, but. Yeah, it never really left the hair and ears and everywhere. It's sticky and icky. <laughs> Who do you want to see get slimed tonight? I want to see Mark Wahlberg get slimed. I think he seems like such a big, tough guy. I think that'd be really hysterical. <laughs> Mark Wahlberg, because I want him to get slimed. I do want him to get slimed. He says that, he, that he's unslimable, but I don't think that's true. Ah, sucker! Sucker, we got you! We got you! <laughs> Yeah. I'd like to see my castmate Peyton get slimed, because I really know he doesn't want to get slimed. Yeah, it'd be hilarious. See myself get slimed. David Hasselhoff. David Hasselhoff. David Hasselhoff. Been saying this. Ross Lynch. I've been saying it all carpet and if it's for real. If you could create your own slime, what would your ingredients be? Ooh, uh, maybe chocolate, and then something that would make it pink, because that's my favorite color. <laughs> Definitely rice pudding, um, got some oatmeal action, and orange soda. <laughs> you guys are awesome and this is for you so thank you. Oh